Okay, today we got a nice little product right here. We got the Ansel battery monitor. It's the BM. It's the BM200 Pro. There it is up there on the screen. And it's also wireless. That's really cool. So this will work with your truck, your yacht, your your truck, your motorcycle battery. And today we're going to try it on the we're going to try it on the solar panels. We've got like a battery system and solar panels connected to it. It will monitor your if you got a small cabin then it'd be great for that. See the condition of your batteries and see where they're at. Okay, on here we got got real-time health display, temperature, power, and voltage. Got alarm for high temperature, low power, low voltage, abnormal starting and charging systems. So it's got the alarm system on it. And this thing is charged also by solar panels. Got a little solar panel here on the top. Okay, this thing's set up for apical battery, all 12 volt lead acid batteries. Input voltage 6 volt to 25 volt. Working temperature minus 40 degrees centigrade to 80 degrees centigrade. Or minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit to 176 degrees Fahrenheit. Power consumption is 3.3 milliamp. It's got a radio frequency of 433 megahertz. Display 9 LED indicators. And it's got short circuit and overcurrent protection. And it's got a lithium battery and 950 milliamp hours. Charging input, solar panel, and type C port, 5 volt. Display monochrome LCD with backlight. Protection, short circuit, and overcurrent protection. Okay, this does have automatic power on and off. So you can leave it sitting on your dash. Unbox this thing. Okay, there's your charging cable. That's a double side tape. There's the unit that fits on the battery. Got the positive and negative leads on it. Here's the actual unit here. And we got a book. All your instructions. That's all in the all in the box right there. Okay, this display. That's what it looks like when it's on. Now I would recommend taking this unit and charging it up with a USB to begin with and uh, get it really charged good. Then you can let the solar panel take over. Let it charge. It's right there on top. If you put it on your dash of your car or your or your truck, stick this on the battery, and this here will also light up. I haven't tested this yet, so we're gonna see what it does together. Sometimes I check out all this stuff really good before I show it, and sometimes I don't. So this little book goes through all your all your information you need to go through. I'm kind of anxious to see what this thing will do. I think I've got everything covered good. Real-time display of health, which means the health of the battery will let you know whether you need to replace it or not. It can be low and just need a charge, but a health if it's got bad health, it probably has a dead cell or something in it. So you will have to replace it. So let's take this thing over and connect it up to some batteries and see what we got. 
Okay, I just connected up to the batteries over there. We'll go take a look at it here shortly. I want to show you this display here. See, it's all 100%. This is probably transmitting to probably about probably about 20 foot over there on the other side of the garage. So everything's 100% on there. You got 100% life. You got 13.45 voltage on there. That's on the solar panels here. It's kind of kind of middle of the day. It's like 1:46 in the afternoon. So you got good sun on the solar panels. Okay, everything's everything's 100%. You also got another little bitty battery indicator over here on the top, top left corner. That's for the unit itself here. So I've had this charged up for a couple days, two, three days, and and it uh, if you leave this thing sit, it will go in sleep mode, which means the display and everything will shut down. And you touch it, and it'll pop back on. So you can leave this thing on in your car, and uh, when you start your car and start moving, it'll it'll pop up display and it'll come back on that's pretty cool when I plug that unit in this little piece right here onto the battery you should have seen that thing all light up it's probably testing all the LEDs in there but it's it's not showing anything right now let's go take a look at that real quick Okay, right here's the unit right here. It's not showing anything right now. I don't see any buttons or anything on you that you push. Okay, there's all lit up. So I guess if you got a problem with this thing, I'll let you know. Let you if you're getting low on your battery or if you need to change the battery, this thing will let you know. So it looks like everything's good. Okay, this is a really neat little unit. You can pick this unit up over there on Amazon. Something really neat to have. Like I say, you can put it in your truck. Your it would also be cool in the camper, wouldn't it? If you're camping way out away from everybody and you don't have a monitor like this, then that would be really neat. Some of the older campers don't have this kind of a technology. So you'll be able to monitor your monitor your battery situation You'll be running your pumps and stuff on your camper radio tv possibly and you'll be able to monitor your your uh battery if you got one or two batteries then you'll be able to see where they're at whether you need to put a charge on it before it gets night so grab a hold of one of these over there on amazon and i think you'll really like it so thanks for watching. And this thing also shows cranking voltage too. So if you're got this in the car or the truck, it'll show your cranking voltage. So that's pretty neat.